Today we'll be taking a look at the Sniper Seat 360 from Benchmaster. I'm Dustin and you're watching Guns of the West. take a look at the assembly process for this and there's not a whole lot that has to be done this much is already assembled in the box before you even get started seat folds up get these uh, straps out of the way these are kind of like backpack carrying type straps seat folds up like that and Benchmaster says on their website and in the instructions that you can use the seat flat on the ground like this if you want to it doesn't have to have legs I think they said the weight limit of the chair directly on the ground like this is 350 pounds and with the legs it's going to be not quite as strong but it's still 250 pounds now i'm getting close to pushing the limits on that myself but i think we'll be okay well to get it assembled i'm actually going to flip it over on its back and then the legs will just go right onto here and they're pretty simple i've got them behind me here They've already got the feet attached. If you want extra height, you can just squeeze these little spring-loaded pins and extend them out, but I think I'm just going to keep them at their lowest setting. You've also got the spring pins here on the base of the chair on each of the four extensions, so I'll squeeze that in. There's the first leg installed. And the second one squeeze the third one there it goes getting my stuff all dusty already here all right legs are on go ahead and flip it over that'll be just about the right height I think now for the armrests I've got those here very very easy to install there's a little hole you can probably see right down there this piece just sticks in there and then you've got these little tightening knobs so you make sure the arm is all the way in and just twist that down tight just hand tight is fine no tools same with the other arm get that in tighten that one down go ahead and sit my chair back up and then the last thing to put on is the rifle rest now i'm right-handed so i'm actually going to put it on this side on both arms you've got a little tightening knob there loosen it up and extend this out you can do it on either side then you've got one here on the rest so i'll slip that over and tighten it on and i'll go ahead uh, let's have a seat here I think yeah we'll keep that extended all the way out and I'm just tightening this one up now you also have adjustments up here but I think we're gonna try it just as it is and another adjustment right here vertically all right well I guess all we need now is a rifle Okay, I, I have to say I like this. I haven't even started shooting yet, but already I can tell you this is a pretty comfortable way to shoot. Look at us. Look at how much more comfortable we are now shooting stuff. I've got 365 degrees of motion here. I won't be using all of that today. And nice thing is you could put up a ground blind for hunting if you're going to be using, a, say, a shotgun for turkeys or a rifle for white-tailed deer out in the Midwest or somewhere. One thing I'm really excited about is we do a lot of squirrel hunting and also rodent pest control with our air rifles. And this seat is going to be fantastic. I just, I can't even wait to go out and try that. And I'll try to get some video when I do. Rifle I'm using today is an air rifle so that you can hear me talking and stuff and I won't have to make too much noise for you. Don't have to wear ear protection. It is the Air Venturi Avenger in 25 caliber. Well, now that we've got set up, let's go ahead and just take a few shots off the seat. I've got a steel target about 20 yards away. Let's try a shot on that. Yeah, got it. Looks like somebody left a soda can out. Let's see if I can't hit that. Yeah, did. <laughs> out here.
out here in the desert, there's always something to shoot at. I don't condone people leave their trash, but at least there's always targets. And with this uh, Sniper C360, I can just get right on them. Let's see. <laughs> All right, nobody's behind the camera, so don't be alarmed, but I'm just going to take a shot over here as well. <laughs> Too much fun. Put another one on the steel. <laughs> and that's all my pellets. Well, anyway, really hope you enjoyed this look today at the Sniper 3, uh, excuse me, the Sniper Seat 360 from Benchmaster. This thing is handy, and you saw how fast it throws together. It's even got the uh, straps on the back of it. If maybe you're going to hike into a place to hunt and be able to carry your things. I'll put a link in the description down below, and I really encourage you to check it out. It's pretty affordable, actually, for what you're getting, and just so, and I can't get over this thing. Please also don't forget to click that like button down below and subscribe to the channel so you can see more videos. And if you look in the description, you'll see where to find me on social media, as well as where to find great Guns of the West products. Thank you so much for watching.